Now, Paramount Home Entertainment did send me over a copy of Trading Places for review, and I did post an unboxing of this. Uh, if you like, check that out. Just search for Trading Places on my channel. Now, I've always been a fan of this movie. You know, I always liked Eddie Murphy, and I'm a big Dan Aykroyd fan, so, you know, I always kind of like this one. It had been quite a few years, though, uh, since I had watched it. If you're not familiar with this, it's kind of like almost like a body swap kind of thing, except for they don't actually swap bodies. Dan Aykroyd's kind of this rich, well-off, uh, like investor or commodities investor. I don't know what you'd call him exactly. And Eddie Murphy's kind of like broke and I don't know if he's homeless or, or not. They don't really say, but he just doesn't really have a job or really anything going for him. And then, so the two main guys at this firm, they decide, well, what if we switch them? What if we made Dan Aykroyd poor and Eddie Murphy rich? Could Eddie Murphy be successful? And could Dan Aykroyd like just fall completely apart and become crazy person. <laughs> and so that's what the movie's about. Uh, the movie really is not very PC. There's a lot of kind of really offensive language and stuff that happens, but it was a different time then. So um, I, I don't know, you gotta give it a pass for that, I guess. Um, I've always really enjoyed this movie though. And to me, the Blu-ray, I think in parts it looked good and in parts it didn't look good. Like I think it's just limitations to uh, the filming process. But um, I definitely think it's an upgrade over the DVD. Uh, so be sure to check that out. Uh, I gave this one a four to five. You know, it's, it's definitely one of my favorite movies of the era.